That is it. Full time, full time. Manchester City nail. Inter Milan nail. Wow. Both teams tried to win this game. Make no mistake about that. Make no mistake. There's a lot of respect between Inzaghi and between uh, Pep Guardiola. But you would have to say Manchester City slightly probably deserve to win it. Maybe 1-0. But I wouldn't say that Inter doesn't deserve a point because it has been a solid defensive performance from Inter Milan. So yeah, nail, nail the finishes. Look, man of the match, who is your man of the match? Let me know in the comment sections. Erling Haaland, we know he shows up. He shows up against Ipswich Town. He shows up against Brighton. He shows up against the smaller sides and score five goals, but he doesn't show up in the Champions League yet again. He does a score in the Champions League. And look, we've seen early Haaland back in uh, back in the time when Manchester City was uh, winning the Champions League. He didn't score a lot of goals. He was the top scorer, but what he does is he scored five goals in one match and disappears for the next three, four, five games. And that's exactly what happened in the previous Champions Leagues. And he started off on a bad foot. I mean, everybody was saying he's scoring hat-tricks every week. Oh, early Haaland is flying. What now? has a score to single goal today so just saying just mentioning the fact that he needs to do a lot better if you want to be the top scorer in the Champions League we've seen Harry Kane score four we've seen uh, Mbappe get on, the get on the score sheet we've seen other strikers get on the score sheet and, and, and Haaland just couldn't do it he just couldn't do it but yeah guys that is it thank you all for watching uh, and um, Clowan, FC Gamer, AJ, Julie, David, all of you, Max, big up to all of you. Make sure you subscribe to our channel. Make sure you smash that like on the stream before you leave. Let me know, like I said in the comment sections, which game we should do tomorrow. The Arsenal game or the Barcelona game. Let me know in the comment sections. Uh, before we finish here, let's round off on the other results. So looking at it on the left-hand side, uh, not a whole lot of goals. PSG won. Uh, Girona nail Paris Saint-Germain got a late, late, late winner at the Parc des Princes and uh, Mendes with the gold, massive win here uh, for PSG. Uh, Dortmund have won against Club Rouge away from home. Celtic also won 5-1. Sparta Prague 3-0 against Salzburg and no goals uh, for the uh, Bologna against Shakhtar. But look, that's a serious serious message I think uh, going back to the conversation on this game it's a serious message for for Manchester City that they're just not going to walk all over teams easily they're not going to be able to do that they're not going to be able to do that and today is uh, as, as an example as an example this weekend Manchester City will be playing Arsenal Arsenal against Man City on Sunday make sure you join us we're going to be live for that game we are going to be live for that game title decider people are talking about title decider already is it a title decider who you think is going to win man city or arsenal let me know in the comment sections but yeah thank you all for watching and uh i'll see you guys on the next one i'm out peace good night